today. Let's go over to our top story. Today is Wednesday, April 1st, a gold day. Today, we are all going back to school. Just kidding, April Fools. Yes, it is April Fools today. Make sure to trick your family today. We have some more HTV at Home videos to share with you. Roll the clip. Hi, I'm Eliana with my HTV at Home video. I'll just be telling you some things that I've been doing while I'm bored and at home. So, one thing I like to do is read. I read a lot. Um, and I also like to draw and paint. And another thing I could do is play with my dog, who's right here, named Sugar. She's adorable. She's a puppy, so she has a lot of energy. Today, I'm going to be doing something that you guys may not know how to do. I'm going to be solving a Rubik's Cube. Not just one of them, but rather four. Well, let's start immediately.
it for this HTV at Home segment. I hope you guys enjoyed it and have a great day. What's going on, Cocker? My name's George, and welcome back to George Talks About Games. And I know school might be canceled, but that doesn't mean you don't get to play games. Cocker, today I'm going to be talking about one of my all time favorite games, Minecraft. Now, Minecraft is an entirely sandbox game that has multiple game modes, and it can be single player or multiplayer, and it's extremely fun. However, Minecraft is $30 on a computer, and that can be a little bit expensive. But Minecraft is a really awesome game, and if you do have it, I do have some server suggestions for you to play on. The Hive and Mineplex are really awesome games. All Crocker and Minecraft is awesome, and I think you should play. Hey Crocker, it's Tamina bringing you these for today. NFL is adding more teams to the postseason playoffs. The new format will add one team to the playoff field in the both AFC and NFC, making it in the prior 12 team format. Also, the team with the best record in each division will be the only team to get a bye for the first round. This is a big deal because with because an extra week of the rest and practice is much needed at that time of year. That's all for me, Crocker. Let's take it over to Sam with the artwork of the day. Hey, Crocker. It's me, back with another sketch of the Pokemon Gym Leader, Alistair. If you're having trouble thinking of what to draw, just think of one of your favorite things and type it into the and type it in to the internet, and at the end, add concept art. Also, please send me some of your art with the email that's on the screen. You can find, uh, and please title it Remote Art. Today is April Fool's Day. This tradition was thought to originate uh, in 1582 when France changed their Julian calendar to the Gregorian calendar. But people did not get this news, but the people who did not get this news still celebrated the end of the year on April 1st instead of January 1st. They became the laughing stock of people and eventually turned into a tradition filled with merry pranks and joy. Now we present an animation um, featuring April Fool's. Hi Crocker, this is Nolan with your birthdays for today. Today, let's wish a happy birthday to Isla and Jason. Let's send it to Davina with the results of Guess the Person. Hey Crocker, it's Davina and I have some announcements for Guess the Person. Thanks for everyone who responded to the form and the correct answer was J.K. Rowling, who is the author of the famous fantasy series Harry Potter. Congrats to Ava Mercer, the first person. Uh, to respond correctly, and to 7th grade who had the most correct responses as a grade. For this week, who do you think the person is? Submit your responses using the Google form Mr. Hager sent out. We will be announcing the results next week. Thanks, Crocker. Let's take it back to the desk. Hi, I'm Avery, bringing you a brand new segment called Some Good News. This was inspired by a new YouTube show started by John Krasinski from The Office. The happy news of today is about a teddy bear hunt. Inspired by children's book, We're Going on a Bear Hunt, by Michael Rosen, people in neighborhoods all around the U.S. have been putting teddy bears on their roofs and porches, so when families go on walks together, they can look for the teddy bears. Isn't that nice? I hope you guys enjoyed the morning booze. Hi, Cocker. Have a great day. Bye.